does race equality mean to you? For me, it's just for people of all colours, and all different sexualities also, um, to have a, a level platform, to be given the same opportunities of, that the, the other person gets. I feel like the race equality question and issue is, is a simple thing as it shouldn't be. The sooner the world, if it could get to a point of not looking at people's skin colour, religion, uh, sexual orientation, then, then we'd move, we'd be able to move in positive steps. For Amy, we're trying to get young kids into school, into, into Amy, to work with us, to want to develop with us. How do you go about doing that? Establishments must show, they still have a duty to the people that they're trying to employ. They need the employers to know that it's an environment where they can climb a ladder. They should be able to see it, stage one, stage two, stage three, People of all colours at each stage. I think it's very important moving forward that people see that they can fit in and not be uh, judged. For me, sending in a middle-aged white man is not going to work in schools in, you know, in say poverty-stricken areas or areas of where there's uh, high ethnic. No, I'm not even saying sending in a middle-aged white man. And this is why we revert back to culture. It's not the colour. It's it's the, it's the cultural understanding, the knowledge. and some of the most influential people for us were white mm -hmm. because they had a cultural understanding of where we were coming from. The question is to your organisation when you're going out and looking for young people, because I have a view that might be slightly different to the organisation view, but actually I know because I've got the skill set to know actually this could be a benefit to his. Would you as a company hire me? This is the happiest I've been in a job since I'm 47. So it took me till 47 to turn around and say, hey, you're black, this is how I am, this is how it is. Accept me, this is how I'm doing it, this is how I am.